Women come in all shapes and sizes. <laughs> Heartbreak. Heartbreak. It happens. When you least expect it. When you think you can handle it, and you can, until you can't. When the promotion goes to the younger guy who was your assistant. When you spend all those years dealing with the mess and the interruptions and the side effects of birth control, and then when you finally want to get pregnant, you can't. When your ex unfriends you on Facebook. First time somebody calls you ma'am. <laughs> when your fiance gets deployed to Iraq. When the government invalidates your marriage because you're gay. When your child is heartbroken and there's nothing you can do to make it instantly better. When you're wearing your first pair of $750 Lebetons, the ones that took you six months to save up for, and 20 feet outside your front door, you step into a fresh pile of crap. <laughs> when your husband tells you he's bisexual, <laughs> and he's leaving you for another woman. <laughs> That's cold. Or when you've got a great job, great clothes, a king-size bed with protesi sheets, and no one to share it with. Mm. Or when you go to your high school reunion hoping to see the first boy who ever kissed you, and you find out he was killed by a drunk driver. When the love that saved you from the love that destroy you, destroyed you ends, that's heartbreak. How do you know when your love is gone? My grandmother Sophie told me, if you said you'd be there at seven and you get there at nine and he hasn't called police, he, it's gone. <laughs> Maybe that's why when they told me my heart was literally broken, I was sad and maybe a bit terrified. But I wasn't surprised. I I'd had, had so, so much, much practice. practice. <laughs>